Hi everyone, this is Dr. Kim, America's Holistic Foot Doctor. In this video, you'll meet my patient who had this ingrown nail taken off about four years ago and now is infected again. This time he got stepped on by someone and is very angry looking. Let's see how I can remove that. It was infected and now, what happened now again? You're telling me on. you got stepped on, right? Somebody special, right? Yeah. Yeah, somebody special stepped on him and then got it all infected. It looks quite angry, so we need to get it all out. And then this time, last time when I pulled it out, we were gonna kill the root, but that didn't happen. But this time I think we definitely need to do it, right? Yes. Okay. Now he's convinced that we need to fix this permanently, but now it's infected. So now we're just gonna get rid of the infection first and then we'll probably do this next few months to completely kill the root so they won't come back. Right, Jonathan? Yes. Okay. So, because this meat here is going to prevent this a new nail from growing nicely, so we have to make sure that those this area calms down before you do the procedure. You feel it? No. Okay. Well, I'm going to feel later. Oh, you already feeling what you're going to feel later? Yeah. Wow. Okay, you don't feel it, right? No. Okay. Let's see how deep this is. kind of broke through a little bit. As you can see, it's a little small piece, but there's a big piece underneath it. That's the one. It's really deep in there, as you can see. Hi, it's me again. Hope you've been enjoying this video so far. If you have, leave the word angry ingrown in the comments below, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. The deep one that was sitting in there, as you can see. Nothing is trapped underneath that area. It's pretty clean there. Let's look at this end. There's another piece. Hmm? So this big area we call it granuloma. We don't have to really cut all that out. It's gonna as soon as the nail is out, it's all gonna come down. So we try not to do too much here. We're just gonna come down nicely anyway. So we're just gonna make sure that this drains nicely and heals, and that's really all all that needs to be done. So okay, very good. Looks very nice. I'm gonna bandage it up real good. I'm gonna put some antibiotic cream on it. Okay, and then you're gonna start soaking, right? You know the whole drill. Yeah, soak water. it twice a day until I see you in about a week or so. And then we can schedule the permanent procedure sometime within the next few months probably a good idea because we don't want to wait too long again, right? Yes. In case she steps on it again, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, very good. Jonathan, thank you for allowing us to film you today, okay? Yes. Thank you for watching this video. As you can see in this video, this patient was doing fine with his nail until he just got stepped on. 
So sometimes getting stepped on or any kind of trauma to the nail can cause the ingrown nail to come back. Until then, be educated, get empowered, encourage others today.